Well, today is Good Friday, and I admit to you that I have struggled with this my whole life. How can they call something good where the Christ was crucified, that the worst of humanity was done to him? How can you call that Good Friday? Well, there's still a part of me that struggles with that. I have a problem with man's inhumanity to man. But I'll tell you why they call it Good Friday and why I continue to call it Good Friday on Positive Daily Inspiration. It's because humanity threw the worst and God rose above it. And when humanity throws the worst at you. You are reminded by a day like this that you can rise above it too. That you will not be locked down in the worst thoughts about you, the worst things done to you. That you're greater because you are a child of God and you have God with you. And even though others have forsaken you and you have had a terrible time, you've had a crucifixion in your life. Many of us have. There are many forms of crucifixion. When you have somebody tell you that I don't love you anymore, that's a crucifixion. When you have an employer tell you that we don't need you anymore, that's a crucifixion. And yet, I know, and I pray that you know too, that God with you will pull you up and will make you rise above this temporary situation that you are in. Even though it appears like a death right now, it's not. You will continue. I think that's the message of Good Friday. It was literally the death of death. Uh, that death was not a period, but a comma in life. For Jesus, for us. There are many times that we die in a lifetime, or seemingly so, where we just don't have any energy in our body or our mind to continue. And then... God says, hey you, and touches you. And you realize again as you open your spiritual eyes that there is something greater. That there is a tomorrow that you will rise again. As Jesus did on Good Friday. Well, that's the whole Easter experience. That it is not death it is life. It is not being put into a tomb. It's coming out of the tomb. It is not being blocked away by a boulder in a tomb. It is moving that boulder with God's help. That there are no blocks in your life. And when you go through an experience and come out the other side, and you look back, and sometimes it's years later looking back, you realize, yeah, that was a Good Friday experience. But here I am. I'm still alive. I walk among them. And when you go through that experience, you have greater faith. You know that you know that God is your help in every need. Happy Easter, my friend.